morning. We're uh, on day one. Just got out of bed, got out of the room, and we're going up to get some uh, pancakes and sausage. Load up on some fuel. And as you can see behind us, we have got an awesome clear day here. No clear smoke. Uh, we can barely even see the fire off in the distance, so the winds have probably been right. So we're going to go eat, and we'll check in with you later. We uh, made it to the trailhead. Here we are, Duck Pass Trailhead. Gorgeous day, no smoke, luckily, knocking on wood. Uh, met some other hikers that are already up ahead of us. We had to make a stop at the store real quick. But uh, we're here, we're starting, looking forward to it, and we'll touch base when we get up higher. Well, we climbed up about maybe two, 300 feet now. Pretty steep climb. Although, on the AT, this would be hard too, on this kind of an elevation gain. But uh, yeah, we're uh, making it, taking frequent breaks. You know, us old guys, we don't do this very often. I swear, I feel like I'm back in Pennsylvania. Take another break, so you can, uh, Kind of get a feel for what we're doing here. Get the uh, canyon off in the background there. It's a pretty view, but uh, it's just going to get better. All right. I'm not sure what altitude we're at yet, but uh, you know this is why we did this trip for stuff like this. So like I said earlier, it's just going to get better. This is just our first overlook. All right, we just climbed up and got to the top of the first little uh, ridge line, and we have a gorgeous view again. We headed that way, and we actually got a little downslope now. Thank God, this, this uh, trail is not going to be a joke. Oh man, I will tell you what, this is what we came up here for. And of course, we're going to see some other stuff too, but this is our first lake that we've actually come by. I mean, I know you're seeing this on the video, but it does not do it justice. This might even be a good lunch spot. going to be headed not that way but it's up behind the trees there that passes that direction oh my gosh water is crystal clear All right, got our first water crossing. Let's see if uh, Brian's gonna make it. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, he made it. Of course, I have Gore-Tex shoes. We got a, we're down in a little canyon here. And uh, I'm not sure which mountain this is, but man, gorgeous sight. And Duff Pass is right up that way.
All right, we just uh, stopped for lunch. A nice little uh, meat stick, uh, summer sausage, I guess is what it's called, some crackers, some Fritos. So we're all fueled up again. And our uh, dinner table had this view. It's pretty, pretty awesome. I think this is uh, Red Lake. And uh, pretty big canyon here. And you can't really get the sense of scale unless you're here. The camera's not going to really do it justice. But uh, if you want to get the scale of all this big talus slide here, I'll come over here. Those are trees. So, yeah. This is a huge, huge mountain here. Gorgeous. And we're headed right, I believe. Up there somewhere. One of those is going to be the passes. We'll uh, check in with you on the other side when we get to Duck Lake. Well, we uh, got done lunch. We're down here getting ready to make a climb out to our first pass. This is Duck Pass. Uh, we were eating lunch around 10,000, so this is probably up close to 11 by the time we're done with it. It's uh, Pretty impressive, humbling for sure. So wish us luck. All right, so heading up Duck Pass, just for a little bit of sense of scale, you can kind of see people hunting up there. They're about 100 yards from us. And Pass, I believe, goes right up that way. So this trail, like we said, is no joke. It's a, Pretty view, but man, it's kicking our butts. It's our first day, so it's to be expected. We got a little bit more to go. Well, we're still on the way up Duck Pass. Taking frequent breaks, of course. And you can see kind of down that way, the path we came up is up that way. Uh, Mammoth Mountain way off there in the distance and you can see also the smoke is starting to build out that way again. Luckily it's staying off in the distance. I don't think it's going to be coming this way. All right, top of Duck Pass. We made it. And I'll show you where we're gonna be sleeping tonight. Down there is Duck Lake. And it's kind of hard to see. But we'll be down there tonight. Check in with you later. Alright, Duck Lake Basin is where we're just going to stay tonight. we got a little more walking to do, but just to show you what we're doing here. Beautiful. And we gotta head down that direction for our campsite somewhere. Yeah, I know, Lawrence of Arabia look and all that. We're on the 
trail around uh, Duck Lake, Duck Pass Trail, leading up to the JMT. We can actually see it from here, but uh, check out the view. Ryan catching up. But we got to find somewhere to stay at this lake tonight because it's required by the permit because that's where we head down is our first stop. Um, yeah, if you look uh, a little farther all the way down the end of the lake there, end of the lake, there's a spillway that goes uh, drainage out to the uh, JMT. So we got to stay before, 300 feet before that. So we'll uh, keep you posted on what we find. So we're uh, at the very end of Duck Lake here. And up ahead there, you can see the John Muir Wilderness. Or part of it anyway, I'm not sure exactly which course it is. I'll have to check when we get down there. But it's beautiful here. I can't wait to get the tent set up. <laughs> well, still on the way to Duck Lake, but uh, just had to take a little video of this. First real water crossing. And our feet are awake. So we came down over Duck Pass today, which is up that way. And our tent site's up on top of that little rocky ridge right there. We just came down here to take a look and have some dinner with a view. So it was a pretty grueling hike, being the first day for us. We're tired, we're hungry. Um, tents were a challenge to get set up. Uh, rangers jumped on us as soon as we dropped our packs practically. And uh, I guess our spot wasn't good enough. We had to get somewhere where it's more of a, or less impact, you know, like Basically, you got to camp on the rocks up here, but we understand. Uh, and rangers camping right about 30 feet from us. With a dog. Yeah, yeah, has a dog. So, yeah, this is uh, this is what we're looking at tonight. And tomorrow we're going to be going down down the pass. And Hang a left, going up that way. Headed towards Lake Virginia, and after that, probably Vermilion Valley Resort. Catch you later.